All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the Golf Club 2019. I'm trying something a little bit different here with the mic. I'm back from E3 now, and I was recording a couple of videos out in the hotel room in E3 uh, where I was holding the mic up to my face. It was really close to my face, so I've tried putting the mic closer to my face because people said it was much better quality. Let me know what you think, but yeah, I'm back from LA, and I'm on the video grind already. We're getting it because the US Open is on right now. We're going to do a round at Pebble Beach, obviously. Pebble Beach is a f phenomenal course, so I'm looking forward to doing a around here we're just going to talk about day one of the u.s open talk about my trip to la i went to e3 if you didn't know with ubisoft game riot sent me out there uh, i had a blast had so much fun so um yeah drop a like on this video if you enjoy it and uh let's get back on this video grind i got some cool videos coming up as well from e3 of different games like control i'll have some footage for control maybe do kind of a little gameplay video for for that and uh we're gonna do more golf club of course there was no golf club out of e3 but we're gonna be doing it here at home Okay, so this Pebble Beach is the one we're going to play. It has 63,000 plays and four and a half stars. So I think this is probably the best one to go with. They might have a specific um, one for the US Open. I'm not sure. But if there is a different one that you see and want me to try out, then let me know in the comments uh, because I'll definitely do another video after like round two or three to discuss it. It's on really late over here, unfortunately, um, because it's on, I think, on West Coast time. So... Yeah, obviously, I'm just adjusting back now to normal Irish time. I never really did adjust to uh, the West Coast time, to be honest. I was over there, and I was waking up at 3 a.m. every single morning. I was waking up at 3 a.m. and couldn't get back to sleep. So, um, yeah, I wasn't really um, adjusted to it by the time I came back. But now that I'm back, I, I'm, I should be okay for Irish time again. But, yeah, I'm going to have to stay up for goddamn, I think, until like 2, 3 a.m., to watch the US Open in full. So that kind of sucks. Yesterday I just watched Ricky's uh, Ricky's round. He's leading the tournament, if you didn't know. He's tied for the lead. But I, I watched the end of Ricky's round. And then the late afternoon players I didn't watch because I was way too tired. I didn't see Tiger or anything. I actually don't even know how he finished up, to be honest. I might as well check the leaderboard right now while we're talking. But um, yeah, I know that McElroy was three under. Oh, Justin Rose was six under. Okay, so Ricky's not leading anymore. Okay, Justin. God damn. Justin was six under in the afternoon players. Uh, Kepka only finished two under, thank God. He was three under at one stage, I know. Target Woods was one under, okay. Not bad. Dustin Johnson, level par here. I'm just looking at my favorites list. Um, Jordan Spieth, one over. Poulter, two over. Uh, yeah, not bad. It's a good leaderboard for sure. Stenson is up there. Usthazen is tied for second along with Ricky. I just hope Hello Ricky gets it done, though. Come on, Ricky. You can do it, club. man. My, um, my mic Kent. might be a little bit too loud if, my, if I'd like to thank it's this close to my face, but I can adjust it after editing, hopefully. For being with us here today. And then Let's I will figure it out for the future. Right now, but let me know if you do you think this do. is better, if the mic is like much closer to my face. Do you think it sounds better? I'm not sure. People were telling me that I should definitely do it. Oh, no. Come on. That's just unlucky. 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 That is unlucky. Right. Oh. Kind of fucked us there. Actually, without wind, you know, I think I can just hit the 108, to be honest. Now, I have not played this, obviously, because I was in America. I didn't get to play this. So, I haven't played this in, like, over a week now. So, I'm going to be nice. rusty. Trust. And we're putting from but it's fine. about 28 feet out. 28 feet birdie putt on the first. Um, is that going to be enough? Is that going to be enough? Oh, hoo -hoo. come no. on, man. Next time. Next time. All right, time. nice short one for you. Gotta be kidding me, man. Nice putt. All right, not bad. I don't like how there's no crowd, though. After the first hole, even par. Yeah, yeah. Move par five coming out, though. Okay, hole number two. Let's see what you can do here. All right. Into the wind again. Should be good. Hit that a little fast, but that's going to be just perfect. But yeah, guys, E3 was awesome, by the way. just I'm going to do a separate video on like my time behind closed doors with Cyberpunk and Dying Light right 2, which I, I would recommend you check out if you're interested in those games at all, because, man, it was awesome. Like Those games look amazingly good. And I'm super excited for them now after seeing them behind closed doors, especially Dying Light 2. Like, I was excited for Dying Light 2, but after seeing no that, bites. I'm majorly excited now for Dying Light 2. Uh, Cyberpunk, my hype level stayed around the same because I was already fucking just insanely hyped for Cyberpunk. 
and but seeing it behind closed doors definitely gives you a new perspective on how crazy the world is and just how intense it is like it really is crazy the detail that's gone into making this just a fantastic dystopian future and it it just looks amazing no loading screens or anything really it was it was kind of crazy how there was like zero loading screens considering the the depth of the world it was insane and this pot for yeah i'll talk about that uh, in a different video anyway i don't want to spoil it all here because i will have a couple different videos going up for my time with the three i already yes. did um my ghost recon breakpoint okay, and watchdogs legion impressions because i played both of them uh, and I played about 45 minutes of Watch Dogs, nice bird and I have B-roll footage hole. up with Let's that video, and one. then I played about two hours of Ghost Recon, and I have my own footage up with that as well, because um, I got to record that for like two hours. Ghost Recon, wasn't really that impressed with, just to be up front, and Watch Dogs Legion, I was majorly impressed with. Majorly. That's a beautiful drive. An absolute beastly drive. Yeah, U.S. Open's looking good so far, man. It's definitely not looking like a typical U.S. Open, though. It's it, it, There's a lot of birdies out there. Nice. I can imagine uh, that they're going to toughen it up now that they've seen that the players can handle this course quite well. I, I can definitely see them making the greens, trying their best to make the greens a lot firmer and just overall trying to make the course harder, the pins harder to get at, uh, maybe putting on, on, on the back tees and stuff like that because I know they're not going to want it to be like 15 no, under for U.S. Open. Something. If it keeps going like it did in the first round, yeah, he ended up it's going to be double safe. digits under Still par a easily. Work to do though. All right, twelve footer here. Oh, oh come on! I just put too much pace on that. Dang it! Dang it, man! And this next pot for the par. Okay. Put for the par. Nice putt. You're in the hole. You'll stay at minus one after that hole. Minus one. Par four here. Let's have a nice, clean drive. All right. 342, five mile an hour wind off the right. That was a beauty. Pebble Beach is such a, a beautiful nice course, man. You can just drink it in. The beach down the right side. And it's even more beautiful in real life because it just looks so good. It really does. Like Some of the shots that I've seen on Twitter... Some of the, the tweets, the pictures I've seen, it genuinely looks so good, man. It really does. Like the one of Tiger with the cliffs off his right. It just looks brilliant, man. I'm going to have to put a little bit more deal off than this. It probably isn't going to make it, actually, but if I hit it fast... Oh, it is going to make it. It's going to be too far, in fact. That's a good shot, though. Like, look at that view, man. Pebble Beach is something Nine else. Footer here. Let's see what he can do. Let's see what he can do. Downhiller. Breaking hard left. That's what he... No! What? Oh, I thought that was in, bro. Come on. All right, this nice is number one bullshit. Putt. All right. Okay, not bad. One. We'll take it. Okay, one under for the round. All right, we got a par three to come. Index two, is it? Okay, Woo! fifth hole coming up. Tough par three. Tough par three. Yeah, I saw the boys on this one yesterday, actually. Um, hmm. 183 is not going to be enough. But the 194 is going to be too much. So I'm going to try to put some loft on the 194. Nearly almost didn't hit that. But I hit that this perfectly. One Does need to bite, though. Yeah, I thought that it might be a little too far. I, th I don't think the 183 would have been enough. I'd like to actually hit it and see if it would have been enough. It might have just creeped on the front. But I think no matter what... We were either going to be short or long there. That's in. Later! Oh, oh man, way to chip that in. Good Later, job. bitch. In a bit. That, you'll go down to two we'll be seeing you. And we birdied that, and we're following up okay, with a par five as well. Six. Incredible. I remember playing Pebble Beach back in the old days, man. This was one of my favorite holes, just because I remember how hard this used to be for me. And uh, just trying to get it up the hill on the second. That, that was in the Tiger Woods games, man. That that brings back memories. This hole genuinely does bring back such memories, man. Beautiful like memories good. of the Tiger Woods games. Those were the good old days. Playing Pebble Beach, playing the Predator, playing the Highlands. 
I can't remember the name yeah, of that snow course as well. The Arctic course that was super yards, difficult. <laughs> that was a lot of fun too. Okay, do I want to hit the 194? Or do I want to hit the... No, I... Oh, I hit fast. Unfortunate. But I probably did want to hit the 194. If I didn't hit that fast, it would have been probably uh, even more short. But it's not bad, though. We could chip it in again. Maybe back-to-back -back chip ins Get an eagle here. You know how it is. Easy as you like. No, that was an awful chip. That was really bad. I, I was downhill and I tried to just and stab it way go. too hard. One for birdie. Now we're struggling for the birdie. <sighs> no, dude, I'm getting robbed on these putts. <laughs> right, I'm getting robbed the on Let's these putts, man. Right but yeah, it's good here. to be back in Ireland, guys. LA was a lot of fun, but one, honestly, I don't really like the place that much. Like, LA itself, I don't okay, really like it. Like, there's just the green. homeless people everywhere, man. It's crazy how many homeless people are in LA. I didn't realize it was such a huge problem until I went there, and then I heard all about it. And But yeah, it seems to be a big, big problem. And, and there's just tents under bridges. Um, looks like every street you go down, there's like druggies everywhere, man. And it's like... They look like druggies anyway. And uh, that was an awful golf shot. Not good at all. But, like, there's definitely obviously going to be nice places in LA as well. Um, the nice places are going to be really nice. And then the shit places are just really shit for some reason. I don't know. It's weird. Okay, I'm going to put max loft on this and just... That's a beautiful flop oh. shot. What a shot! And Come on. Was amazing. I'm the best. Getting that birdie from the bunker. Nothing I'm like the it. best, Three dude. Under for the round. Why am I so good? Okay, let's see what happens here. Two chippings and three holes. Four. One out of the let's bunker as go well. Go ahead and drop this one into the fairway. And this hole there. as well. This is just iconic. This hole's iconic. I remember the Tiger Woods games though. You used to be able to just go for the green. <laughs> remember that? <laughs> you used to be able to just go for the green here. Go to drive the green in the Tiger Woods games. Oh, Absolutely like zero chance in, in the golf club. 408 yards. I don't think it was that long in the Tiger Woods games. Maybe you're playing off front tees or something, but... Yeah, there was no chance. Okay, we're about uh, 200 yards out here. In this game. Zero! I'm actually just going to hit this because it's downhill. I know that I'm going to hit it a little fast. And it's going to work out. It's in the hole. What a shot! We're on fire all of a sudden, baby. That's another birdie to add to the catalog. Four feet to the hole, you can do this. But yeah, guys, if you're not subscribed to this channel for some reason, you're watching this video, Nicely done. please do Dropping subscribe. I do golf 30. club videos That's on the awesome. regular, and then I do all Bring sorts of other content as well. I'm looking to kind of make a switch and just start and editing my videos more. Not up. for the golf club, because I feel like it wouldn't work well for the golf club, but for my other videos, like my multiplayer videos and shit like that, Looking to do more high edited videos. I'll also have an E3 vlog going up if anyone's interested. It's not going to be like crazy in depth or anything, but just a couple cool clips that I had. Um, so that will be going up within the next couple of days as well. And as I said, the control video. Other than that, probably my impressions for Cyberpunk and Dying Light. And that's about Sweet. it. All right. Other We're than that, I don't think I have really too much to do. Yards out, I'd say, from here. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna hit the. I'm definitely not hitting the 225. There's no chance. I might be good actually. Eh, I, did, I didn't allow for enough wind. My grand is calling me, so he's probably wondering how I got on in America. I'll be right back. All right, my grand is actually gonna call down and see me. So, uh, we need to get this video wrapped up quick. Let's go. We're gonna chip in for the third time in four holes. No, that was a little bit to the right. Not a bad effort though. It was actually turning back. If that had more pace, that might have had a chance to go in. Okay, let's see if you can save power. Yeah, I'm really here. looking forward to watching the U.S. Open tonight, actually. It's pity Ricky's on really Decent late tonight now, but I'll, but I'll get to watch Tiger Woods and them early. I wish it was like the the, Very solid round. <laughs> the top guys went out fantastic. first. Obviously, that wouldn't make sense, but just, just for this tournament, because otherwise I have to stay up to like 3 a.m. to watch this, man. It's going to be a Coming struggle. I'm really not like one. someone that here. stays up late either. I'm like fucking in bed by 10 p.m. kind of guy and get up early. I always get up super early, but... I never really stay up super late. Definitely not 3 a.m. late anyway. Never. 
I used to. Back in the day, I used to have a fucked sleep schedule. I'd stay up to like four. Very but I still nice. get up early. Like Even I'd if I stay up late, like I still get up early. There's nothing I can do to stop myself getting up early. Especially because I have a, a, hus a husky who does not like waiting around to get his morning walk. I tell you that much, guys. He wouldn't be long waking me up if I was going to sleep in. Which I usually don't, anyway. Alright, that's a beauty. He was so happy to see Sweet. me yesterday as well, guys. You go for your birdie. I've never been away from him for like longer than a day. And then I just randomly go away for six days over to America. Uh, he was con My dad minded him, but he, I think, I'm pretty sure he was confused. And my dad said he was a little depressed. Yeah. So when I came back, he was saying his mood is way happier. Just in the house, in and around the house and everything. Uh, and then my dad yeah, took go. off this one for to pie. go back home yesterday. But, yeah. Woo! And a nice putt. I was super happy to see him as well. He, he actually, my dad brought him up to the airport. The and when he saw me, he just Keep bolted over to me. Ran over, jumped all over me. Got hairs all over my clothes, by the way. But it was fine. I didn't mind. And that was a beauty. drive. Wow. That's a beauty. Echo. Look at that view, man. Pebble Beach is something else. I really want to watch as well just for the spectacle of Pebble Beach. Like, obviously, I'm going to watch it. It's a major, but, like, it's really, like, an added spectacle just I'd seeing those views in the background. I'd yards or so to the pin here. 105 yards or so to the pin here. I'm going to put a little bit of D-loft on this just because uh, it's uphill and it's in slightly into the wind. I would say the wind is hurting just a slight tad bit. But that's looking Ooh, like it's right at the flagstick. What a golf shot. We're on fire all of a sudden, baby. Let's go. Four feet. Let's, go. Let's do this. I nearly yes. missed that. <laughs> I nearly missed that. You see the way that just broke off to the right immediately? Your but yeah, we're approaching 77,000 subscribers, guys. So that's what I was saying earlier. Okay, if you haven't subscribed already, please do. Hole, I'd appreciate so it. Can do. Um, as I said, I'm hoping to start making more quality videos going forward. Just Not just kind of... Just gameplay and nothing else. I want to start. Oh, that was awful. I flicked that. Not just Not uh, this one. gameplay and nothing else. I want to do more edited videos. I want to get into yeah, more of the editing side of things as well. Right Especially, like, I was over at E3 and I was talking to this dude. We were talking. We got kicked out of the Ubisoft conference, right? Because we were standing up down the side. I actually went with Ubisoft and I ended up getting kicked out of the conference just for standing there. I, was, I wasn't doing anything bad. I wasn't being a dickhead or anything. Like, I was just standing there, uh, but we're not, we're not allowed to stand down the sides of the the aisles apparently we were in the back corner like no one could see us but they kicked us out into the overflow room and i was talking with this dude he he also got kicked out and we were just like well the atmosphere is not as good in here because you couldn't even hear the crowd screaming or anything because the doors were closed it was like i don't know it was not as good stuff. at all but we were talking about how the conference was kind of mediocre at best and we were just kind of having a laugh and then i found out his youtube channel his name was tuxbird and when I went home, I checked it out. I just, he gave me his YouTube. I gave him mine and I gave him my Twitter. He followed me on Twitter. I followed him back. And then I went home and checked out his videos. I just said, yeah, let's check out his videos. He's telling me he was a Rainbow Six Siege YouTuber. Like he only plays Siege. And um, one of the biggest ones he said. So I, I was like, yeah, he's probably a pretty big YouTuber then. And I went home and he has 1.3 million subscribers. I was like, All God right, damn, move. son. And he gets, like, near a million views on well every done. video he uploads. Like, it's crazy. Imagine getting a million right, views on that, every video you upload. Like, that kind of a ratio. Having 1.3 million subs and getting near 1 million views on every video you upload. Superstitious. Um, uh, kind of crazy. Number 13. This uh, is just but I, number I watched his videos, you and do. you can see why. Like, they're they're funny as fuck. They're really funny. Check out his channel, by the way, guys, if, if you're looking for a laugh on Rainbow Six Siege. Tuxbird. T-U-X Bird. As in... A bird of prey, anything like that. Um, but yeah, they're really Good funny. They're highly here. edited, though. I was looking, and they're just like he has, you know, those videos where they have the when they're talking, they have the subtitles come up on the screen in different colors and shit like that, like for added effect. All right, and right around yeah, they're just kind of clips from Rainbow out. Six Siege of them fucking up, having hilarious fails, shit like that. But they're highly edited, and uh, you can see why. It gets so many views and gets so much traction because you can see he puts a lot of work into those videos. And that's kind of what I want to start doing more of is like putting a lot of work and love into the videos that I'm making rather than just making them for the sake of making them. And I think it's going to 
yield better results for my channel as well because right now i have 77 odd thousand subscribers and there's certain videos where i get like fucking 300 views on and like what's actually the point of me even uploading those i mean like certain series like that i do gameplay walkthroughs and i know let's plays are never going to do as well especially for kind of games that are everyone is doing a let's play for uh, they're never gonna do as well, so I need to like stand out from the rest. That's what I need to do as I hole putts like that the for the golf club content Like my views on the golf club Sitting content always is top notch You guys absolutely bang it with nice the support for the golf club content round. And I want that to be like support here. on all my videos if you know what I mean Like I want to stand out. I, I stand out with the golf club videos because I'm like the only one that makes golf club content consistently I feel like no one else really really does that and the people that do only have like, you know, uh, they're, I'm not trying to shit on them, but they have like really small YouTube channels. So I was like the biggest one to like start playing Roy McIlroy PGA Tour a nice and the golf club games. And I played all of them consistently. I've uploaded consistently golf club content since like Roy McIlroy days in 2015. So like obviously for the support okay. to keep up, I must be doing Let's something right with the golf videos, right? Yards uh, but... With the other videos, like, it's kind of random. Some series do really well, and I'm happy with it, and some series just do god-awful, and there's no point in me even uploading. That was a terrible shot. This could be Slow dirty. on the way back and fast on the way through. But yeah, sorry for, like, unloading this on you guys. I feel like I'm just rambling, but I kind of wanted to get it out of the way, just talk about it a little bit. And definitely, like, in the future, just... Um, I don't know, change things up and start doing more edited videos for multiplayer videos. Maybe even, like, single-player content kind of more editing and funniness involved in the videos maybe even incorporated into the golf videos a bit we'll see um i've been thinking here we go this putt maybe get an editor or something or maybe P get pico to help out with editing because i know he's looking to try edit videos and shit sweet and um, he's one of my moderators if you didn't know he does my thumbnails not for the golf club i do Six my own for the thumbnails round. for the golf club and i do my own thumbnails for some Shit as well, but usually if I'm doing up. like a big series, I got him to do my thumbnails for me. Like the Ghost Recon and the Watch Dogs Legion thumbnails, he did those. I think they're pretty nice. And that's going to be nice right there. Like Beautiful. But yeah, sorry for just ranting and ranting. I feel like I've been talking for fucking ages. But yeah, I just wanted to kind of give you guys a lowdown on other content if you're interested. Most of you guys probably just watch me for the golf content anyway, and that's fine. I don't mind that at all. Like, if you just watch me for the golf content, that's fine. I watch certain people just for certain games as well. It ain't no issue. I don't have an issue with you. I still love you all the same. But yeah, maybe give some of my other videos a chance if you're interested in other games as well. Because I am planning to do more editing and nice. shit like that. We'll see. Okay, Going forward. Okay, footer here. This is definitely makeable. Get in. Let's go, nice baby! I've just bird. been calmly, casually making birdies as I'm <laughs> as I'm talking to you guys. Four out of the last five are birdies. We made one bogey, but we're seven under for the round. I didn't even realize we were that low. Holy Part shit! Four here. Let's have a nice seven under at Pebble drive. Beach. Let's go, baby! We'd be leading the tournament right now. Holy shit! Did not even just realize we're seven under. That's gonna be too far. Yikes! Needs to slow down, baby. Just stay in the light. Stay in the light. Ooh. It does stay in the light. I, is that tree going to be hanging in our way right now? No. We're fine. This actually isn't a bad light at all. I'm just going to hit this. Solid swing. Slow. Dang it. Really? Huh. Actually, it's going to work out fine. Good thing I did hit it slow. Holy shit. That came off that shit fast. Nice. Here we go. Drop this one for birdie. Drop this one for birdie. But yeah, I decided I'd get right on the golf club grind again. Come on, come on. Turn. Where's the turn, Ooh. man? Because I haven't uploaded a golf club video, obviously, since before right, E3. Three uh, since I finished my career mode, in fact. This is my first golf club video since I finished well my done. career mode. I finished the career mode, if you didn't know, guys. If you missed that somehow. And that'll we keep finished our first season in the career mode. And I've kind of lost as to what to do with golf club content now. Right, just random right, videos three. like this here and there, I guess. Let's just just, drop like just it on um, and, uh, talking we'll about the there. golf tournaments and playing along the same course. Could be interesting. Could be fun. I like doing these videos where I talk about like the U.S. Open. Shit, I think I'm going to need to put... 
A little bit more. I think this one's going for it. Sit! Sit! That's a good shot. This was tough with that win. You gotta love the water views, man. For the birdie. For some reason, my PlayStation's getting super loud now towards the end of this round. I don't know why. Weird. Okay, I'm gonna... This is fast downhill. Dude, I don't know why that went left so much. Like, I did put it out to the right a little bit, but that didn't look like it was breaking all that much at all. To be honest. Like, it didn't look like it was breaking okay, much this one for at all. Boom. Solid okay. putt. We're in the hole. It's another par, though. Seven okay, under, so not bad. Let's birdie last. At seven under for the round. Par five, and it's in like seventeen. So maybe an eagle. Eighteenth hole coming up, and then you can. Ooh, hang look at his view, baby. House. Let's see what you can do here. I ain't no pussy. I'm going right at this bad boy. Oh, I did pussy out. Look at that. That's looking nice I just pussied out of it majorly. God damn it. That Layers of Fear 2 thing came up right as I had the perfect thumbnail as well. Now I'm not going to be able to get it. Damn it. Come on, bro. Like right as it was the so perfect moment for a thumbnail right there. Right There's a lot of beautiful holes out. on this course though, so it's fine. Put some loft on this bad boy. Play it out to the right a little bit just because... That's the way it's moving. And that's an absolute beauty. It needs to sit down, in fact. Sit down there, ball. It's a beauty. And it's a great eagle chance. It's a great eagle chance to shoot nine under. And it looks like you're putting for eagle from here. Nine under. That's not bad at all. It is not bad, huh? And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to make that eagle putt. Because that's just and the way I roll, baby. Let's go. Let's go! Well done. Nine under at the end of your round. Nine right, under 63, today. baby. Wait, so Thanks this is par 72. Whereas the one for the US Open is par 71. Weird, man. That's weird, is it not? Are they playing on like a separate... Are they doing it like differently for Pebble Beach? I don't know. Pebble Beach is dope, though. Anyway, guys, I was just checking if there was, like, a different course for it. So it just says Pebble Beach. I don't know. So let me know if there's any other Pebble Beaches on the course creator that you might want to see me play when I'm doing my videos after round two or after round three or after the, the final round. I'm not sure how many I'm going to do. We'll see how uh, how jet like damage and shit like that. But I definitely wanted to at least make this first video talk about Ricky. Ricky leads the way. Uh, anyway, guys, hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did... Make sure to drop a like, subscribe if you're not already, as I always do say. And I shall see you guys for more golf club. Golf club? More golf club in the very near future. It's been a pleasure to serve you. Peace out.